Hello and welcome to our beauty, lifestyle and fashion show. I'm your host Adeze Adwaka and these are the headlines. Tyler beat Thames, Aria star, David O to win 2024 VMAs. Aria star and Rema spotted dancing together in TikTok video. Kanye West and his kids North, Saint, Chicago and Sam perform everybody on stage in China. Cottage Kerr meets country in Casey Musgrave's first Reformation collection. And Arya Star goes full sparkle in her VMA's after party look. And on our trending segment, Tyler won the best Afro beat at the 2024 VMA's. Tyler's smash hit Water fended off competition from Arya Star's A Last Heartbreak song, Chris Brown's Sensational, featuring Lil J and David O. Usher's Ruin featuring Feels, Thames Love Me JJ to the award. Tyler's Water has dominated the award season with the song winning the Best African Song Performance category at the 2024 VMAs. Tyler made history as the first female African artist and the first South African artist to ever win a VMA. During her acceptance speech, the singer spoke out on the categorization of all African music as Afrobeats. I know there's a tendency to group all African artists on the Afrobeats. Even though Afrobeats has run things and has opened so many doors for us, African music is so diverse. Now, Tyler is really kicking it this year. Like, since last year, she has been taking awards back to back from, you know, now the VMAs to the Grammys and all of that. She is really, really doing so well for herself. I mean, I'm so proud of Tyler. I mean, she's doing us females proud, you know what I'm saying? And she's doing us Africans proud. I know David O has been nominated times to, but, you know, Tyler is just, I don't know, there's this glory and there's this thing that comes with her that anytime she goes for any award show, she just takes it. Like, it's as if when she comes in, she just dominates and, you know, she beats every other artist on the same category. There's just something about her. She's just an it girl. And I also love the fact that, you know, she pointed out that Afrobeat should not just be a thing about Africans. You know, anytime they mention Africans, it's always just Afrobeat that comes to people's head. We do rap too. We do hip hop too. You know, we do R&B too. So we're not just Afrobeat artists, you know. I think Tyler was actually right on that one. So good luck, Tyler. And we're looking forward to more songs and more awards for you. Well done, girl. And on our spotted segment, a TikTok video of Nigerian artists Rema and Ira Star participating in a trend has been making rounds online. In the video, the two could be seen partaking in the Azaman Dance Challenge. The trend was inspired by Rema's song of the same name. I, I really wish I could do that. I'm not very good with doing challenges. But I think Arya Star and Reva actually killed it. I saw the video and, you know, Arya Star has a banging body. Reva also has a banging body. So you can imagine the combination and them doing that video together. Mm, the video was steaming hot, you know. And that as a man trend has been there on TikTok for a while now. And I know that, you know, they just wanted to jump on that trend because I know that Arya Star and Reva have a very, very close friendship. Aside, you know, working under the same record, label they really really are close friends so it's also good to see artists promoting each other whether they're under the same record label or not it's just beautiful to see and they really kill that trend guys I, I just can't do it and on our editorial segment Kanye West turned his vultures listening party into a family affair the artist brought North, Saint, Chicago and Sam out on stage with him for his concert at the Wuyan River Sports Stadium in Hanan, China, per a video posted to X. The video showed the little ones walk out together as West get up to perform his rendition of the Backstreet Boys 1997 track, Everybody. The crowd cheered for the Grammy winner's children whom he shares with his ex-wife, Kim Kardashian, as they danced along to his vocals. At one point, West's wife, Bianca Sensori, proved she was a proud stepmom by recording her stepchildren from the VIP section of the stadium. The model kept a close eye on the kids as their famous father performed, with a video posted to social media showing Chicago cuddling up in Sensori's lap. Wow. 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 <laughs> well, one thing you will not take away from Kanye West is, is that he is a good father. He's a very, very good father. You can see it in the way he fights for his children, even on social media, you know, he just says, 
you guys stay away from social media you can just tell that Kanye is a very good father and I actually love the relationship that he has with Bianca I don't know it seems I know they sound like the weird couple but they seem to understand each other in a very weird way and it's also good to see that you know their stepmoms were actually good you know back here in africa sometimes when you say someone is a stepmom they just see you as a very wicked person they just see you as a bad woman but you know it's good to see sensory taking good care of you know Kanye West children to the point that you know not is even sleeping on her lap that's to show you that they actually have a very close relationship. And I just hope that, you know, most relationships are actually like that because it is really rare to see. Sensori is doing a great job as a stepmom and I love the relationship that she's trying to foster, you know, between her and Kim's children. It's very beautiful to see. So, well done, guys. And on our new collection, Casey Musgraves just released her first ever fashion collab and she thinks the 17-piece collection is a perfect line to frolic around in. The singer is known for her country folk meets pop rock aesthetic and is frequently seen sporting denim, cowboy boots and puffed sleeves. All of these make regular appearances in her first ever fashion collab which comes out just in time to wear to her upcoming Deeper World tour. Filled with muted tones and rustic fabrics, the pastoral inspired Casey Musgraves and Reformation collection is a reminder to slow down and appreciate your surroundings. And on Spicy or Not, Afrobeat artist Arya Star looked stunning while on the VMA's red carpet and during the after party. The singer went full sparkle in her after party look, wearing a fitted bodysuit covered in brown sequins and matching tassels. Arya accessorized her outfit with a dainty gold necklace, hoop earrings, and a gold purse. Mmm, Arya. I think she's known with her short, short, you know, outfits. Well, you know, whenever you see a short skirt, next thing that comes to your mind is. Arya star but I really really love how she rocked this outfit she is really killing it and I think you know she's now known as you know a fashion goddess because the way she has been pulling off iconic looks I think there's a style to her and she has maintained that style you know throughout all her outfits and all her outings and she really looks amazing I love her body I love how she rocks her looks so proudly and with so much confidence and also how she accessorized the entire look she really looks beautiful and don't forget to catch us up at spice tv underscore africa until the next episode do have a lovely time bye